Hi everyone, this video is definitely going to be more, um, I guess I'm going to tell age regression or a little space, but I, this is definitely going to be a video about, um, check out my necklace I made, isn't that cool? It actually goes for my bicycle, but I do wear it, so it's pretty cool though, right? But anyway, I'm going to be showing you all my, I guess, age, how do I say this? Age Aggression Lookbook, I'm going to title it, so... I don't know how it's going to be or look, but I'm going to show all you guys my age regression dresses and stuff like that. And where I got them and all that jazz. So, here we go. This is the fresh dress. And remember, I am 5'7", height, and 190 pounds. But this I got in the girl section. This is the extra, extra large 18 plus size. Which fits, but what sucks, I'm small here, but... I'm bigger here and here, but I'm tall. But to make me look shorter, what I do is I wear knee-high to thigh-high socks, even in the hot summer, if I'm not dressing like religious. But here's the back and the front of it. And it's got like a gingham plaid. The only thing is I can't bend over in this dress, but I can sit. I can either wear shorts under it or hmm, a slip, which I know that's kind of stupid. They're beats the purpose but yeah my cuddles <laughs> and i got another dress i got this one at the girl section i know it looks really tiny it looks like a blouse but it's actually i like that it has like uh it's the same thing as this style dress it's got like a i guess they call it a trim bib it looks like there's a bib around the collar it's got like a bib trim it like a, it's like a blush pink this is our extra extra large 18 it's their plus size, and it, the problem is that I'm tall. So, I'll try this one on, and I got plenty of other, but when I slim down more, I'll start wearing these again, but I wanted to get it for only 11 bucks. I could add trim to this, I guess, or wear something under me, but most girls, you're not going to bend over this way. No, you squat down. That's being proper, but... Uh, things that make, you know, if you are a little in the middle and you're 5'7 height or taller, uh, I'm probably gonna do a video on how to make it look shorter. I came up with just two solutions so far. Wear oversized jackets and tops and clothing. I don't wear jeans, so obviously skinny jeans are better, like dark black, dark navy, dark blues. But skinny jeans are not in fashion anymore, and I don't wear them because of religious reasons, and I'm too fat. So, but... Uh, another thing is always wear thigh high socks or knee high socks um, and you could wear stuff that like as long as it covers your kneecaps um, you'll give the excuse me you'll give the illusion that you're shorter if you are going for that looks like myself so what I'm doing now if I took these socks off I would probably look really tall all you see is long legs like yeah my legs are still showing but you don't see my skin so I'm wearing the knee high socks and I like thigh high, but I got these a hot topic. But um, this is what I do to make me look shorter or feel more petite and tiny. So I don't know how it's coming off on camera, but it's kind of got this like sailor flat bib, and I got like the back of the trim. It's nice. I just got to slim down more. So, but I'll show you the next dress I got, which you see. But I'll try it on. Did I mention I hate being fucking tall for a woman? I hate being five seven. It makes you feel really manly and ugly and inadequate. And, yeah, I gotta definitely lose more weight. Yeah, this is really tight on me. Um, I just fit it, but, yeah, no. Okay, here's the back of the dress. Um, it is a little snugger in here, you can see it. Like, I just fit their plus size, but it is a little too small. But once I slim down and lose another 25 more pounds, I won't have as much back fat on me. But I can still fit. I mean, it's a, it stretches here around me. It just, my shoulders, but... Luckily, I got small boobs, so <laughs> anyone out there who's uh, a tall girl, and it's like a berry pinky red, I like it. I just wish it was a little longer. I wish like, I had an extra ruffle and it come down to my knees. But this is another dress. Uh, I got the like, little collar. Super cute. I like it. It's kind of got that little girly baby vibes and like dollhouse feel. Kind of got that. Like, that's a good one. Creepy cute. Like, you like my little canopy, guys? Look. You can see it. It got like a little canopy here, but... Yep, in my uh, Animal Crossing bed sheets, I did a video on that. But here's the, the yellow sheets with the houses on it. But you guys seen the other one. But yep, uh, this is the one dress. 
Uh, on to the next one. Hope you guys are enjoying this as much as I am. Funny, funny. Okay, not to say I would wear this, but I forgot to show you guys. Yeah, I got this, like, uh, rainbow Mickey Mouse Disney print. Um, this skirt I'm wearing. Now, I got three of these skirts. I'm not going to try these on because it's a lot to do. But I got them at Walmart, and they are their extra, extra large 18. Here's their rainbow skirt with the rainbows. I got this at... And it's got ponies and hearts and stars on it. And both these skirts, right here, both of them, like this blue one, has shorts built in. See? And they're stretchy shorts. And they actually fit me better than the dresses do for some reason. They're skirts and they're, um, their skirts and their pajamas, their 18s and girls, all fit me perfect. Which is their big plus size. But I could wear this and walk out the door and just feel... She was just a shorter skirt, but I would feel comfortable because I got the like knee high socks, so I probably look shorter than I do if I was like wearing tights. But yeah, say it's got the shorts under them, built in, which I like, so you can crawl, play, be an ABD, a little girl or boy. And ow, that's what uh, the back of it. And I wanted to show you this dress, I'm not putting it on. I have a lot of uh, age regression clothes. This I got in Amazon. It is a imitation Lolita dress. This is a 2XL. I don't care that I'm saying my size because I'm so fat, but I'm losing weight since I'm on new meds. Here's the belt you tie behind you. This is, um, I need help with this song getting it, but like my dress, it has like what I call a silver, a Peter Pan collar. And it's got like underneath here by the bust, it's one, a one piece or an OP. And this is a cheap version of Lolita. I don't care, but I do like dressing this way. It's cute, it's Kayui. It reminds me of like, you know, uh, Nymphet fashion. I'm really into Nymphet fashion. Uh, dressing like a doll also. And age regression, any of those I'm into. So you don't have to come at me, but I'm just being honest what I like. It's my channel. But I got the bows. This I might wear to the fair with my caregiver. And I should have got this in black. That had been like very gothic Lolita and baby doll vibes. Might wear this with a black pair of tights or white. I'm probably going to wear black tights so I don't get it dirty. But if I'm sitting on the dress. But it's got lots of lace and frill. Super girly. Very girly girl. Prissy, sissy vibes. Fru fru. And this still does fit me. I just need help getting dressed because this is... <laughs> Uh, yeah, it's very difficult to get dressed in the morning or wherever, and, uh, this is the dress, so, on to the rest of them. This video is gonna be really fun, I like it, and I compare them with my pink lowly glass, I got these at the Dollar Tree, and they actually still fit me, and they're meant for, like, kids, and I got them in red, and they still fit me, and they don't make my face look, like, like, big or like i'm trying to wear younger glasses they actually just genuinely fit me so it's kind of cool but um uh, i will try on the rest of them so i think i'm gonna title this uh age regression lookbook Woo! check out my little tiny pony collection yeah check them out <sighs> I love that. Them three. Colorful, very pretty, very girly, girly, baby girl vibes. Love them. <sighs> yeah, I'm wearing the same socks with this look. With this dress, love it. Fits me good. Um, This is a lot looser on me. Um, hope you guys can see it. <laughs> um, I, I want to get like a little princess candy be tent. tent. That'd be so cool, I think. But this is my purple star. I got this in another Walmart. And it's got like this slit. It's kind of a short like a baby doll dress. And I like it. I just wish the sleeves were long. But I'm not 11 and 12 or 10 years old, unfortunately. And I'm 5'7 height. But just to do age play and wear this. Super girly and cute. And I hope you guys like this video. I'm happy I got a small bust. Thank God I got small boobies. But this dress is really sexy. Very, I love the stars. Very girly girl baby vibes. The sleeves, I do wish they're stretchy, but I do wish they were longer. <sighs> I hate being tall. Is any other girls that are littles and middles in an ABDL or DDLG lifestyle suffer from this? I'm sure Mylon C. Diaper does, because she's tall like me. Just saying. But, yeah, it's annoying. But, you know what? At least, uh, it fits me, but, yeah. 
I'm just, if I was 5'1", it'd be better, but whatever. It's a cute dress, though. Okay, this dress is super girly baby vibes. I love this dress. It's pink with ponies on it. I hope you can see it. I love it. It's super girly girly. And it's kind of a sweater dress for the fall time. But I could wear a pair of like black or like creamy beige boots to wear. But when I'm noticing to for me to look shorter, because I'm 5'7 height and I'm 190 pounds. When I get down to 160, uh well, 170, I mean, i will be a lot thinner than I am now, but 160, it'd be loose. 150, they'll be a lot looser and fit me better when I get down to 150 pounds, which I will. But this is like a ponies, little girl vibe, love it. Super baby girl, got pockets in it. It's got the little belt and it stretches. I actually had to cut the sleeves off and make them a little shorter because they were tight around my arms. And But with this, I could throw on a white little cardigan, a white little sweater. Super cute. I even got like this shirt, which I'm sure you guys have seen in my other videos. I have a lot of uh, plus size little clothes from Target and Walmart. And if you are a girl who is shorter, God bless you because you can wear them. Once well, you don't have a big bust and you don't have a big stomach slash waist. This is super cute. I usually wear this with like a long skirt or something. And it says pick me and I love this. And I wear usually a white shell under it only because... Um, I'll show you what a shell is. We call it a shell in the Jewish religion, in the Hasidic Jewish religion. We wear this called the shell. It covers your collarbone and um, your wrists, all the way to your wrists and your collarbone. It comes in multiple colors. In Brooklyn, I usually get just black, white, and cream and beige. I gotta get more. This is what you would call a cream or a nude. And I wear them sometimes under shirts like this just for modesty and more baby girl cutesy vibes because it gives it more of that like cutesy little girl aesthetic look that i'm going for and very nymphic fashion also so yep <laughs> so but i like this dress and hope to goodness i'll keep on losing weight and things will be a lot more looser on me hopefully i will I got this dress at Mandy's in Brooklyn, New York. This is definitely a baby doll dress. This is more for juniors. It's not the little girl's apartment. This is an XL. And this is a mint green. I love this dress on me. I have another one in there. It's like a yellow. I will show you guys the dress. But I don't want to try them all on because this is going to be a huge long video. So it kind of fits me like this one. So yeah. Um, I also have this, which everyone saw me in. My cheerleading outfit for my Jewish school, uh, Baxter, base Ruckle school, pretty awesome. And let's say, uh, really? Wow. Okay. Um, here is this dress. This is what I call my, this is kind of the same style of dress as this minty blue green one, but it's yellow and it's the same lane, same style, just a different color. But it's very girly, baby doll vibes. I love this dress on me. It, I know, try it on, but I'm just showing you guys. I have a lot of like little girl clothes on when I'm feeling little and stuff. And then like, uh, this is gonna be a long video, but whatever. If you guys like this, you know what to do. I have this one too, it's another short, uh, looks like a blouse, but I got this at Manny's in Brooklyn. Their store is no longer um, around in business. It's called Mandy's. M-A-N-D-E-E -E is the right spelling instead of M-A-N-D-Y. But I got this years ago and I was skinny, skinny when I wore this. I was, this is large. Um, I was 149 pounds, but I was like super into my anorexia. <laughs> love it, love anorexia. I got this dress at a Walmart. This is definitely an XL. And um, it's a little looser on me, but it's got that like cute girly baby doll vibes. Another one. I hope you guys can see this. Hope it looks good on camera. I'm really working hard here. Uh, those I will not try on because it's just a lot. And then I have this dress. I mean, this is all my age regression. This is more of an, a teenage girl. This is extra large. I got this in Brooklyn also at Mandy's and it's sort of closed. But I, um, I love pinks and yellows and like baby blues and lavenders. I love pastel colors. 
like the FLDS. I love their dresses also, which I have a couple of them still. And yes, I'm from there. Um, on to the next dress. I'm wearing the same socks throughout this video, but I don't care because I have other ones, but these are just black with white trim. You guys can see. I don't care. Um, this is my pony. Oh my God, did I just, I broke the hanger. <laughs> Cause I'm fat. Um, this has like a, a unicorn gold. It's got the pockets, like a dark navy blue. I just want everyone to see what I look like here and stuff. Sitting on the bed, I am 5'7 height. But anyway, um, this is the dress, super cute, super baby doll. This one's a little loose around me. I think if I stretched it out, but whatever. But it still fits. I had to cut the sleeves off of it. The sleeves were down here because I'm tall and I hate my arms and I got to near, near my arms again. But this is the one dress. Um, knee high socks, super cute, love it. Um, this is a cute girly girl dress. Here's the print, you can see it. I'll show you guys the other next dress. This collar looks really good on me, and I like it, and yeah. Um, hopefully you guys can still see it, <laughs> the whole dress, I don't know. Um, this one I like on me, it's got lavender and green, and the Prophet Kenny and Wendy and the First Wife. Pick this one out, it's got little like ruffles off here. Thank God I got small boobs. Uh, if I was a big busted girl and I'm tall on top of it, none of these age aggression little girl dresses would be fitting me at all. So what helps is that I am like small boobs. I'm a 38A. Once I lose one weight, I'll probably go down to a 36A. So I probably could fit into a 38B, but the B cup has to be really narrow and small because I don't have really wide filling breasts. I have more long pointy cone shaped. Kind of like Madonna in the 80s. My breasts are naturally that way without wearing a bullet bra from the 50s, just being honest. So this is one of them, and I love the color on me. I love the style. Very cutesy. You know what should be really good? You guys want me to do a makeup tutorial? I need to kind of do like a creepy doll look, like wearing cute baby girl doll clothes, aesthetic with bows and lace, but like kind of creepy, like maybe like darker makeup or darker accessories. Comments down below on this content. I would love to know. Because people want me to do that. It's something different. And I'm willing to try anything once. Wow, this is really short on me. Just saying. Um, I like this. I have leggings and matches. But they're like a light blue. But this is my this is actually one of my dress I wore on my FetLife account. Um, but it's got butterflies. Yeah, my tummy still sticks out. But it's kind of like a short um, baby doll link dress. Like I wish it was like at least covering my kneecaps. I think that would give it more of a baby doll, nymphette, little girl, cutesy, age regression vibes. I'm just using different words and different acronyms because I can. But this dress, I wear like a cute cardigan. Um, I only have one cute cardigan that's like little girly baby doll vibes, like doll looking. It's got pony stars and unicorns, but I don't think they would kind of go with this dress. Plus, I'm just so wacko and I'd wear it anyway because when you're age regression and you're in that mental state, I don't sometimes match it. I don't care, but it's what it looks like. Uh, I got two more dresses to show you. And yeah, this is, I love this one now. Love butterflies. Very nymphette, ecstatic look. I love this dress. I love this dress. This is definitely my gay pride dress. I love this one. It's got rainbows and lace. And this kind of style is a little bit more looser around my waist. Um, even my waist is down here, but remember, this is not meant for the typical adult. This is more for like clearly ages 10 through 12 or like even 9 through, I'll say 7 through 12. <laughs> but it fits me. It's an extra, extra large plus size 18 at Target and Walmart sells them. Their sizing might be different, but if you are a girl in this lifestyle, whether you like age regression, dressing like cutesy like a doll or doing little space, and I'm using all these Ackermans and words because my channel, I do a little bit of everything. But I could post this as Nymphette. I think I might. Um, or Nymphette fashion. I like this. I mean, once my arm, arms trim down and I have to nail my arms, I do it like once a week. I do everything. And my hair's probably looking a mess because I got my hair in bobby pins and it's probably coming out, but I don't care. <laughs> and you know, this is a good movie. A movie. Yeah, it's a good movie. Right, Cuddles? That's Cuddles. And, um, yeah. 
I'm gonna try the other one on, and I tried my best. Oh, tell me these glasses are so Lolita and Nymph fashion. Very, like, humper humper, and I love this. And I like the style of that, and I think they look really cute. And it's actually, these I got at the Dollar Tree two years ago. And I know, like, in, like, stores, they go for anywhere from, like, 15 to 25 dollars for heart-shaped glasses. And these are actually meant for kids, and they fit me. Luckily, I don't have a big face. Yes, I'm fat, and I'm a little thicker than I was a year and a half ago, but these still fit my face appropriately. And I should start wearing these. Cause they're super girly, baby doll vibes, age aggression, little space, nymphette fashion. I love them. What do you guys think? Cute, right? I had the same kind in Barbie pink that I love once again. And like I said, they fit me really good. I like these and I think they're like super adorable and I love them. And they're just like super girly, girly baby doll vibes and age aggression, little space and ABDL rock on, DDLG lifestyle. But these are very nymphette fashion and Lolita X Xets, which is a good movie from the 1997 version. I don't like the 1950 or 1970 version. I'm not quite sure exactly what era and year, but there's another movie called Lolita and like the book is way in, in depth and way better, but I actually like it. But it does take you to a darker side. That's all I got to say, but open-minded, just saying. But I got these, they're like a Barbie pink, and I got these, and they are very cutesy, very girly, and I like these on me. They're very baby doll, girly, girly look. So, yep. On to the next one. Did you say the next one, lovey? No crikey bloody way, eh? Oh my gosh, this dress with my pink glasses are so the shit. This is their plus size, extra, extra large 18 at Target and Walmart in the girls section. I like the lace, it's got one tier, two, and a slip. I wish this slip was a little longer, but remember, it ain't meant for my height or age. But this dress got sparkles on and it fits me really nicely. And it's got like little girl vibes, baby doll vibes, aesthetic, super age regression playtime creepy doll vibe look like i love the glitter i love the sparkles and it's so nymphette very nymphette appropriate um comments below what you guys think if this is a very nymphette look which i don't know i always wondered i hate to say this and i know everyone's gonna probably come after me don't come after me or comments but like my opinion one thing i know is with all these lifestyles they have in common they all want to look youthful playful young and pretty for example nymphette fashion lolita which is like the Japanese uh, word for Kayui. Kayui, I'm saying it wrong. K A W I. K A W I L L I A. Kayui. Sorry, if you know what I'm trying to say. Um, age aggression clothing. Cutesy. Instead of saying Hawaii. Kawaii. That's the word. Kawaii. Kawaii fashion is cute. This dress falls under Hawaii, Kuwaii fashion. I have to say Hawaii and then say Kuwaii afterward because of my speech impediment. So Hawaii, Kuwaii, Kuwaii fashion. This dress is very Kuwaii and also like Hawaii. And uh, I noticed all those groups in lifestyles have one thing in common, like I said, is to look cute, playful, fun, youthful, not to, you know, hurry up and grow up, not to rush, not to look like a slut or a tramp. Like, I, I've noticed society's changed. A lot of girls say dress way too old, even when they are this age, young, and they're like ages 7 through 12, and it's disgusting. And it's like horrible, but that's a whole other topic. And, you, you know, one thing I like about modest clothing, like the FLDS religion, like I grew up in, or the Hasidic Jewish girls, or the Amish girls, you don't see those girls, like, getting assaulted or commented at or really cute because they don't dress inappropriate. American women, I noticed, dress very outlandered, outlashed, and that's what I like about the Japanese fashion, Hawaii, kawaii fashion also, because it's modest but cute and playful. You can still dress cute and playful and youthful, like the Lolita, the Nymph fashion, the ABDL, DDLG fashion, whether you're a boy or a girl, you can, you know, like the Lolita fashion, the Nymphette, fa the Nymphette fashion from 1997 movie, Nymphette fashion, Hawaii, Kauai fashion, Nymphette fashion, ABDL, DDLG, 
uh, cutesy girly girl baby doll clothing or the baby doll vibe like you want to dress like 1950s housewife is cute you can make that young and youthful by wearing a bow and a ribbon in your hair um, making it a little even if you're wearing a longer dress that's more adult and modest you can add bows in your hair and cute accessories like that or you know wear a little like an shorter like anywhere like to your knee or above the knee or covering your kneecap depending on your height makes you look shorter and sh petite and like more girly youthful and playful that's just my opinion through all this so this is this dress and i love it and this is one of my last ones i'm showing because i don't have any more but if I had to actually count all my dresses, well, here we go. <laughs> oh, yeah, and this was one of my, this is my other FLDS dress. Uh, you've seen videos, it's like a light gray. I shortened the sleeves. Uh, you can watch any content like that FLDS. Um, if you want to watch anything with the FLDS, click any videos that have the name FLDS on it. Anything that says age aggression or little space, you can watch those and thumbs them up. ABDL and DDLG stuff also. Um, just giving you guys some titles and names to remember for them. So, um, you've seen all the dresses I showed you, but I'm just going to count the ones that I showed you on video for now and add them all together. So, I got one, two, three, four, I guess I should show this one. This is my uh, punk rock gothic gay pride one. It's got a rainbow collar. It's got the zebra. This is, uh, I got this in Hot Topic. This is a large and it's got the same kind of like girly, girly baby doll vibe feel to it. I love this dress on me. So I can add that with that one. <laughs> I ain't trying it on though, but um, yes, I like that dress. So we're going to count now. I also got mad onesies. That be a video. You guys want me to do all my onesie collection? Comments down below. On this video, if you want me to do all my onesies and try on haul, that'd be fun. So I got one. Hold on. Oh my goodness. Oh boy. Let's see. You know, this is not going well. <laughs> I also got this dress. I forgot. Um, this was pants, and I actually cut it down the middle and made it into a dress. Um, if you can see, and it's actually the. A little bit longer on me and it's a tie-dye hippie dress and i got this one also kids apartment i usually wear a white shell with this this is another it's more form-fitting but this is just as cute and sexy and playful and it's really good and fun for age aggression or nymphet fashion so to me it's slightly similarities i'm just using different ackermans to me they're the same so whatever okay here we go i got one Two, three, four, five. I'll say six because the other one's in a dirty laundry. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen age aggression or nymphet fashion dresses that are in my closet. Probably got 20, because there's probably two or three that's dirty in there. Let's just say 20, even it out. That's a lot. So, yeah, daddy dom. Um, check out my onesie. I probably wore this already, but I, I gotta wash it, but um, I wore it twice. Got the ducks on it, and this is like an extra, extra large. Um, I got two sizes bigger, extra, extra, extra large, because you know, their extra lodges now are too snug on me, but once I lose 20 more pounds, the extra lodges will fit me again. So, don't binge eat, everybody. It's bad for you. So, yes. Um, hope you like this kind of content and video. You know what to do if you like it. So, there. Love you, subscribers. I hope you enjoyed this. If you like it, thumbs it up. Comments below. If you want me to do all my bottles and sippy cups, comments below. Or I can do all my onesies. I think I did that. If you scroll down to the bottom of my videos... I think I did a onesie, ABDL, DDLG onesie collection haul. So, yeah.